Hi friends, today we are going to talk about one very important thing, accruals. So lots of times, you know, coming from a technological background, engineer or anything, unless you are from the finance background, you will not know what is accrual. Accrual is something very simple. So you have work performed. So that means here the orange color is you. Okay. So what happens is, suppose you have done work for someone and he's going to pay you in future. So that means accrued revenue, client pays you later, okay? Very important. Now, anything that you are buying, like you're buying a house, you're buying a car, or if you are buying, so then you need, you will going to pay it later. That is accrued expense. One is revenue, one is expense. So ideally this minus this should be zero, or this minus this should be greater than zero. Otherwise, you are in deep trouble, okay? So that's basically what is accrual and in SAP when suppose you have outstanding payment that you have to pay you have to accrue. Now how will you know which one which which are how to find the accrual. Now I'm going to tell you how you can find it in S4 HAN. Okay so let's go to SAP okay and here is our table. So what we are going to do is this is the this is the view you are going to check you are just going to do control c and i'll just go to sc16 okay or you know i have already or i have clicked on it so let me go to create a new session and i go to sc16 and here i'll just put this and here if i execute these are all my outstanding thing that i need to pay okay so this is my accrual. S4 HANA has made it very simple. Okay. In the front end, they have also created a accrual, uh, uh, a Fury app that you can use. So I'm just checking the code behind the Fury app. So this is very important. The simple thing, the view is FISD underscore open ITM underscore zero. Okay. So they, so this is something that you are outstanding. That means you have not created. Now, if you want to go into the details of it, I can just show you the select condition. If you notice, this AUGBL is the clearing document. So if there's no clearing document generated, that means you have not issued the payment, it will not show. Okay. So those are the ones that you are talking about. So this is very, very, very important in the final, in the in the finance side and in accounting side. And I, I'm pretty sure 99% of the clients who use SAP uses FICO and accounting. So this is very, very, very important. Okay. So that's it. Stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning and have a day.